So, summer is coming, or for some of you, summer is already here. And you may be scratching your head thinking about, oh, what am I going to do with my kids all summer long? Well, if you're one of those parents, then keep watching. Mommies of Jen, I'm Vanessa. And I'm Samantha. And thank you for watching. And if you're new here, please go ahead and hit that subscribe button and ring the bell so that you can get more videos like this from expert teachers and moms on how to teach, love, and care for your kids. Hey guys, so we wanted to share with you some of our five favorite free activities to do with your kids this summer. And uh, we just want to remind everyone that physical activity and social opportunities increase the chances of your child performing better in school. Yep. So that's one of the reasons why I want to encourage all of these five activities. Yep. Tip number one, go on a picnic. Get a basket ready with your favorite foods and bring a blanket and head to the park. Um, and lay it out in a fun area and a nice relaxing day and a relaxing setting with a friend of yours and a friend of your kid and have a yeah. nice picnic. Awesome, play frisbee, um, jump rope, do everything that you used to love doing as a kid and you can get actually jumping rope in there with them. Yep. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right, so number two is go for a bike ride. This okay. is one of my favorites. I love it. Um, if you have toddlers and you are into riding your bike, I recommend getting a seat for the back of your bike and go ahead and taking a stroll, always with safety first, of course. Everybody, especially mm -hmm. that toddler in the back, should be wearing a helmet. Um, and the whole family just going for a bike ride. Yep. Tip number three is to go for a nature walk. So go for a nature walk and use it as an opportunity to teach your child about keeping the environment clean along the way. You can talk about littering, um, promoting good skills like, oh, you see a piece of litter, let's pick it up and throw it out because we want to keep a clean earth. Um, great exercise and a great way for the entire family to get outdoors. Yep. And tip number four is visit a sprinkler park. It gets hot. So go ahead, again, call your kids' friends, invite them to the sprinkler park, and it's mm. free, um, it's gonna cool them down, it's gonna tire them out so that they can go to bed late at night without a problem. Which brings us to tip number five, which is find a free movie at a park near you. So we live in New York City and there are always weekly free movies at the parks. Um, New York City, Parks organization has a website and it has a calendar of events of, for this. Um, and if you don't have that in the town that you live in, you could set up a screen and a projector in your very own backyard to have a movie outdoors. How fabulous! Movie is that? under the stars. Yeah. And you can actually um, check out projectors at the library. So you may want to call your local library to make sure that if they have projectors available for you to use. Mm -hmm. All right, guys, so we want to hear from you. How do you spend your day with a free activity during the summer with your kids? Comment below. We want to hear from you. Also, don't forget to subscribe and ring the bell so that you can continue to get more videos like this. Thanks for watching. See you next time.